All right, buckle up, animal lovers. We're diving deep into the tool shed of the animal kingdom. And trust me, it's way more exciting than your dad's garage. Get ready for some mind-blowing, tool-using critters that'll make you question everything you thought you knew about animal intelligence. Let's kick things off with some feathered geniuses. Crows, specifically New Caledonian crows. These birds are basically the MacGyvers of the avian world. Check this out. They don't just find tools, they make them. They'll take a twig or a leaf, modify it with their beaks, and create hooks to fish out insects from logs. They're basically crafting their own fishing rods. And get this, some crows even have preferred tool shapes. It's like they have their own little tool kit. And it's not just hooks. They'll use sticks to probe for grubs, or even drop nuts onto roads so cars can crack them open. Talk about urban adaptation. Now let's dive into the water and meet some furry tool experts, sea otters. These adorable little guys are masters of shellfish cuisine and they've got a secret weapon, rocks. They'll float on their backs, place a rock on their chest, and use it as an anvil to crack open clams, mussels, and abalone. They even have favorite rocks they'll keep tucked under their armpit. It's like they're carrying their own personal cutlery set. And it gets even cooler. Otter moms will teach their pups how to use tools, passing down this essential skill. It's like a family tradition of shellfish cracking. Dolphins use tools. The most well-known example is the behavior of bottlenose dolphins in Shark Bay, Australia. Here's a breakdown. These dolphins, primarily females, use marine sponges to protect their snouts while foraging for food on the seafloor. This sponging behavior helps them avoid injuries from sharp objects and stinging creatures. This is a learned behavior passed down primarily from mothers to their daughters, indicating a form of cultural transmission. Also in Shark Bay, some dolphins use large empty shells to trap fish. They will chase fish into the shell, then bring the shell to the surface and shake the fish into their mouths. Okay, now for the undisputed champions of tool use in the animal kingdom, chimpanzees. These primates are practically our tool using cousins. They'll take a stick, strip it of leaves, and carefully insert it into a termite mound. The termites cling to the stick, and boom, lunch is served. And they're not just fishing. They use stones as hammers and anvils to crack open nuts. They even have different tools for different tasks just like us. It's like they're running their own little workshop in the jungle. But here's the kicker. Different chimpanzee populations have different tool using traditions. It's like they have their own regional tool cultures. It's not just instinct, it's learned behavior passed down through generations. So why is this important? Why should we care about animals using tools? Well, it shows us just how complex and intelligent these creatures are. It challenges our assumptions about what animals are capable of. It also highlights the importance of conservation. These animals are facing threats like habitat loss. By understanding their intelligence and their unique behaviors, we can better protect them. If you enjoyed this video, smash that like button, subscribe for more amazing animal content, and let me know in the comments what animal you think is the ultimate tool user. And don't forget to share this video with your friends and family. Let's spread the word about the incredible intelligence of the animal kingdom. Thanks for watching and stay wild.